I got my box. I've been waiting for this box for a while. This is the HDO goggles. Let's go open this up and see what we got. Let's open her up and see what we got. There's a knife. One, two, three, There we go. There's the box. Nice and shiny. Let's go open her up. Oh, the obligatory cellophane shrink wrapping. On the floor. All right, by the way, here's a trick. Get a little piece of tape, put it on the side, take your box, give it a shove. And that's the easy way to open these sleeves. All right, there it is, Fat Shark. Take it out. And of course we have our inspected by sticker, our download full product manual, our obligatory usual stickers. Great, and this is the same case we always get. And there we are with our cloth on the top, neatly folded. Our new battery and it's plastic anti-static. And woo, look how shiny. It looks very much similar to every other Fast Shark goggles we've ever had, except it's black. And of course we always know things are bigger and better in black. And ooh, there's that soft padding I've heard about. Ooh, it feels like my Burka lounger. Ooh, can't wait to try these on. Everything else really seems, you know, just what you would expect. There is a definite nice click right there in the, int, in the interpupillary adjustments, which is a nice change. Your HDMI, your audio, your receiver on, off, your remote, your inputs, your power, your mic. And if we open up the compartments, I'm sure this is the same as always. Yep, there's our Fat Shark module bay. And we're not going to be using this, but ooh, that is tough. This is the other bay. Whoa, that is really tight. Well, I don't need to open it. <laughs> I guess I'll just leave it. All right, very cool. Let's see, check out the battery. Read user manual before using. Warning, danger, Will Robinson. Copyright infringement. Right there, Danger Will Robinson. Okay, can we get this open? Now this is supposed to be the new kind of battery, which has, where is it, where is it, where is it? <gasps> Look at that, a USB charging port. Can you see that? That's very cool. So instead of the removable batteries, this is a all-in-one self-charging. Look at that, you had a nice place to tuck that in. That is thoughtful. When you compare the old one, which doesn't have that little hole there. Whoops, did this side. Oh, it does have the hole there. It does have the hole there. I've never used that before. Everything looks the same, except for, where is it? Where, that charging port, which we don't have on this old battery. Other than that, it's really absolutely the same size. Any power in this? Yes, it ships with a charge. And of course it works just like the old one. Wonderful. And of course, if I put it on, I can expect, oh, I'll take this off. If I put it on, I can expect to see snow. Let's make sure that everything works fine. Looks like they beefed that up a bit. Plug in our fan port. Fan works, let's see. Oh, how do you turn the fan on now? Oh, there it is. I can hear it. Here, fan. Okay. Let's see if I can see snow. I probably shouldn't be doing this without the... Ooh, I see blackness. What if I turn the receiver switch off? Nope. I don't see anything. That's interesting. If I go through the displays... Whoa! That's cool. Cool. 
Well, I'm going to have to try this uh, with my computer and see how nice those screens are because I can't tell anything without a module in there. So, what the hell, let's go get a module in there. Okay, let's try this quad with this battery. Plug that in. And let's see how this looks. Whoa, that is some picture. It really looks like a TV set. That is amazing. I'm gonna have to get used to this. I, you know, this, this, going from the HT3 to this, this is not so terrible. This is actually amazing. I love this. This is great. Colors are really crazy bright. All right, great. There you go, the HDOs, and I think this is gonna be great. I can't wait to take this out to the field. Looks like watching TV.